What is up guys, Pro Player Apathy back in the building with a, another video and today I will be bringing you guys a live comm on evac domination I will be using the so called FAMAS It's called the, what's it called, the FFAR I unlocked this gun yesterday and the supply drop got pretty lucky so I've been wanting this gun for a while now and oh my god it's like, it's, it's flooded me But I'm glad I'm using it now but really, really, really what I want to talk to you guys today is about something really important Something that's been in talks, something that's on my mind. And you know, I like doing one of these live comms videos, something related to Call of Duty, obviously. But I like to do these live comms once in a while, talking about the game, talking about practice, talking about a lot of subjects. And today, damn it, I wanted that kill. But today, I will be talking about practice. Now, when I mean practice, I mean a lot of things. So, a lot of you guys know, I mean, it's, it is so much to cover. But I'm gonna try my best to cover it, you know, cover everything. So first of all, we all practice every day. Call of Duty is mainly being played online, right? We don't have as much event, uh, events as other teams. We don't, you know, our gameplay is mainly on online. Like that's what that's where we practice, and our practice are just scrims that can be very boring, very repetitive. But it is what it is. That's what we have to work with. Now, with that being said. Uh, obviously, especially when you're a player who's been playing for a long time, for example, like me or any any veteran player when they've been playing for a while, obviously playing for a long time, you know, you aren't always going to take scrims 100%. And that's normal, right? Because the reason you're not going to take scrims 100% is because obviously, like, imagine playing Call of Duty the same way for so long. Like, once in a while, you're going to mess around. Okay, this guy thinks he's Goku. And, damn it, I wanted a hater. But once in a while, you're going to mess around once in a while you're gonna slack and it's just normal dude we're human we're not perfect we're not always gonna take everything super serious we're not gonna take something we do every single day for years and just randomly you know we're randomly gonna mess around here and there or we're randomly gonna slack it's just normal but that's what um <clears throat> that's the bad thing because practice is so important uh practice should be taken so serious you know the teams like optic i remember when we when we scrimmed them and it beat us like 250 to 27 or whatever it was in the hard point. You know, they just, we knew they took it so serious. As soon as we were down by like 80 points, 100 points, we stopped caring as much, right? We stopped trying as much. We could have easily maybe came back to at least 100 points. But it just, it's just a mentality, you know? People lose full. People are like, this connection sucks. This and that. Oh, we had a bad start off. I didn't want to play this map anymore. And that's what scrims are. Scrims are really could be really bad for a team and like optic what i'm trying to get is optic takes scrim so serious like to the point where they don't they barely ever mess around like they will mess around once in a while but there's a team definitely that takes scrims this, this they take it so serious more serious than anyone i've ever seen any team i've ever seen like i tune into crim streams once in a while i tune into formal streams scum stream and every time they're playing they're scrimming they're just going so hard communicating very well and obviously you want to practice like you play you can't make excuses you know when you're practicing the only way you're gonna get better is you practice like you play right like once in a while you know i mean i don't even play around that much anymore i used to joke or joke around sometimes with scrims lately for the most part like i've been wanting to prove i've been really focused on taking scrims a lot more serious and going hard but it's hard to take scrims serious all the time if you're getting joked it's obviously hard if you're struggling on a shitty connection it's hard if if, if you're bored or if you had a rough long day you know and the scrims are just they're just so boring or you're playing like a bad team and it's boring it's hard but that's that's what differenti differentiates the, the from winners to losers that that's like a that's like a big difference you know when you think of optic you, you don't they usually obviously if they're not playing the best team they won't go as hard sometimes it's normal but they take every scrim very serious for the most part they they take practice way more serious even a team like rise takes scrims really serious they all turn off their streams you know no one streams scrims you know they go really hard and they make sure they're getting in that good practice and even though you know it's turning on streams not streaming it's not a huge difference but obviously it kind of is now why you ask me first of all streaming scrims obviously isn't the worst thing if you're playing respawn it isn't a bad thing but first of all it's just streaming scrims you're already you're already being a little bit distracted you know by stream by your chat and it just it's a small distraction and on top of that you know you're kind of worried 
about what they think or you're worrying what what they think about you you know you might play differently you might not go as hard there's just there's just a lot of reasons now obviously if you have a good mentality you know players like optic streaming or not streaming they still go hard they take a shit 110 percent even some people go harder when they stream like sometimes when i'm streaming i go harder than i would you know just scrim normal because i have something to prove and obviously i want to i want to play well in front of the stream like i don't want to shit the bed so you go harder so a streaming could be a good thing but some people just find it a distraction and a team like rise you know they turn off streams they go hard when it comes to practice time and i respect that and like i said like the top teams right now are pretty much optic and rise like obviously you know you have your elevates your lg your phases and they're they're all good like they're all good teams like they're top teams but your top two teams rise and optic i think those two teams are the are the ones that take scrims the most the most seriously i don't you know i don't the most serious you know they they're teams that take it extremely serious they don't play around you know they go so hard and it's just they're the and you shows that they're on top like i'm not saying that's always going to be the factor because obviously you need to have individual skill it also depends on the amount of time you're putting but obviously then again practice is pretty much everything you need you need good practice if you want to get better you need good practice if you want to perform like there's no way around hard work like you have to work hard and a lot of a lot of teams a lot of people don't understand that but you know like the teams that mess around are teams that are like oh like even optic everyone does it like don't get me wrong like optic rise we do it like when you're when you're on your shitty host you're getting joke like it's hard like i take scrims for the most part really serious like i might not go as hard all the time like go super hard like sweating balls and holy shit like it's much like some teams do but doesn't mean i'm not trying doesn't mean like when i'm getting joke i'm just staying composed you know i'm trying to really take the script serious really just focus on improving and not worrying if i'm getting joked what the case is but you know it you can't like practice like what i mean by practice like you play is pretty much when you're scrimming like don't do stuff you're not going to do in a real match don't do stuff you're that's not going to make you better you know you want to practice like you're actually going to when you play in a real match or when you got a big tournament coming up or in a league match or anything like you want to practice like you're going to play communication uh gameplay wise you know focusing on on how to get better like nobody's perfect right nobody always makes the right play like there's times where people are going to make the wrong play it's it's perfectly normal you're human you obviously don't know everything you know there's team there's players who are stronger in other areas than other teammates uh, than other players there's gonna be oh, i had a heat wave him like there's gonna be players who are are really good at certain at certain areas and, and there's gonna be other teams like some teams are gonna be a little bit more individual skilled than the other but the other teammates gonna have a little bit more teamwork than the other and it's just it's just it's a it's like that like it's a circle so you can't expect to always do the right play you can't always expect that oh i'm the best player in the game and nobody can beat me you, you know what i mean like you're gonna do bad here and there you're gonna have bad plays here and there and really what you want to take from that is you want to get better you want to you, obviously you got to realize first of all that you're doing the mistakes this guy trying to shoot the hitter now you got to realize you're doing the mistakes and get better from it like that that's all that's all it really is it's not it's not much to it if this guy's lagging dude i had it been so close to nuclear i had it been so close and the guy just lags in and kills me whatever that's not the point of the point of this video I know I'm kind of ranty right now, but I just really want to explain, like, and just show how important practice is. Like, Optic is the best right now. You know why? I think they're obviously beatable, but they're just so prepared in so many situations. They're just so ready to beat anybody for the most part. Like, they're, it's not like I'm saying they're not beatable, but they're just so prepared. Situational, they know what to do. They know a lot of things. And the reason why is because they take practice so serious. They put their self... And it's such a, and it's in a in a situation where they're just so fucking prepared. Like there's no other way to put it. And that's what everybody should be doing. Everyone should be exact. Should take it optic as an example. Like everyone, like including us, including any any team that's not first. Like maybe Rise is close with them with like practice. You know they take practice very serious too. But even then, they probably play on a shitty host and a scrim, and they just lose full, and then they, they waste their time. But it's, it's just in general, man. I, like, I think they're setting such a good example. They want to be the best. They're putting the time. They obviously have the talent, but a lot of these teams have the talent as well. It just comes down to putting the time and make sure you're getting that good practice and practicing like you play. 
and I could sit here and be, you know what, I'm a victim of that. You know, I I can't sit here and like contradict myself because I've done that before. I fucked around. I've taken scrims not as hard. I've taken scrims not as serious. But that's a mentality that that's not that's it's. Obviously, like, I go hard scrims, but for me to have a higher chance of winning, to have a better winning mentality, I need to start focusing more in improving and getting better as a team. And when it's practice time, scrim time, taking it more serious and stuff like that. But either way, guys, I hope you enjoyed this gameplay. It was a pretty, pretty 43-5, almost got nuclear. I don't, I don't even know what happened. This, 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 this was crazy. Like, I, I was just, I was just fucking gunning around while talking. But don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Practice like you play. It's going to help you get better, and I'm out. But this has been your boy, Apathy. Now I'm out. Peace.